Amy Morgan and I'm a silk artist. I used to be a potter and I sometimes dabble in pottery now and again, but mainly I've been enjoying silk painting. When I was young, in school, I remember having such freedom in my art classes. There were always rules about math and science and language, but in art, you got to really flex your muscles and see where you could go and the teacher never got mad at you. And so I thought that was the way to go. The things that drive me today are uh, the sweet moments that you have in between all the busyness in life. I spent a lot of time going to school and I was apparently indecisive so I just kept going to school. I got a graduate degree, a teaching credential, and I did teach high school and college and enjoyed that immensely. So having kids myself, there is not a lot of time for the art. So when I do have time in the studio, I will find that my images return to pleasant, colorful animals and uh, travels into jungles that I would like to explore myself. So, as a result, my art is about finding my bliss. Being an artist is like being a foreigner in another land where you arrive and you have to learn the language a bit, but once you start speaking that language, the, the, the new foods, the new smells, the new sights, they can be a little scary, but the world opens up. And when people know that I'm an artist, they have some little twinkle of curiosity in their eye. Teaching art has been really rewarding. Some kids aren't happy with their day, and through art, they find their purpose. Thank you.